Hello. Hey, Pyro. You're gonna be lurking while you're working? Sounds good to me. We're gonna have a slightly shorter stream today. Probably gonna go for about two hours, something like that. Um, and yeah, I'm excited to get into this. I'm also just still getting myself situated a little bit. I feel like I've been kind of all over the place today, but that's how that's how it be sometimes. Um, let me game, please. Make sure that my controller is uh, not gonna be too fussy. try relaunching the game. I don't know why my controller isn't responding, but I do remember this happening one time, so let's just let's just try turning it off and on again. Yeah, there we go. So thinking of where we left off last game, I was starting to sort of like explore a bit more and try to get to places I hadn't been before to varying success. I'd even say low success, <laughs> but um, I'm eager to, to get back and try to uh, figure out where we left off, like, or, or try to build on where we left off. You'd listen to this title screen uh, for hours on loop if you could. Yeah, this has been a great soundtrack. Like, I can see this becoming a, a staple in my in my music listening. Such a comfort blanket. Yeah, I can totally see that. There's, like, there's a couple of games that I always just go back to um, for the soundtracks. All right. Cool. So thinking of where I left off. Oh, I've also got a cat in the window over here. Maybe she'll make an appearance at some point. From where we left off. You're heavily affected by good music. Yeah, what were some what were some good games specifically for the music that I listened to? Um uh, Journey, Fez, I think had a fantastic Oh, that was my first time going to the Gravity Cannon. Huh. I thought I'd... I was like 99% positive I'd been there before. Yeah, Journey is fantastic. Hey! How's it going? Ugh. Ugh. I'm, I'm, I'm waking up a little bit. I don't know. I've been very tired all day. Um, but but how, how are you, uh, Kusanagi? And how are you, Pyro? You're bad at lurking. <laughs> Good to see me back on Outer Wilds. Yeah, I um, I was just saying I'm, I'm planning to play for about two hours today. Um, and we'll see how far we get. There, from where we left off, there's like a handful of things that I really want to figure out um, that I just didn't quite get last time. So, specifically with the Sunless City. You're going to sleep soon? Yeah, I, I'm probably going to crash early today. Um, I really want to get to the sun station, and I want to get to the... Where? There's a... Uh, the High energy lab. Yes. And I know that we're going to learn stuff about the high energy lab at the Sunless Sea. Sunless City. And then my idea with the Ash Twins is I think if I land... You know, let's start with this because I think it is, uh, uh, oh, I can't mark this one. That's all right. We'll just, we'll just go there. It's all good. Yeah. 
But yeah, I, I don't know. I feel like I'm, like, juggling a lot of things today. And so, like, my brain is just a little bit frazzled. So I'm just like, let's do a little bit more exploratory of uh, Outer Wilds runs. The sand hasn't even started yet. So I have one theory about um, one theory about how to get to the high energy lab. Yeah, I guess I was just pretty speedy. I was planning to go to the other planet because I, I guess it time doesn't move when I'm in that uh in that menu in the ship logs. No, out. Okay. One of my ideas for how to get to the high energy lab is if we um get to that spot where I was getting stuck with the wire and then wait for the sand to be the same level as the platform that I'm trying to jump to and then run across then and hopefully not get squished. I am worried that I'm just going to get squished but if I do well short run and then I'll just come back and I'll try the other thing for the uh, other side of the ash twin. What I want to do on the ash twin the other one the sandy one is um, I want to try to use one of the teleporters there to get to the sun station. time on this one. I'm getting better at <laughs> doing this route. You know, like eighth times the charm, something like that. Alright. So we're gonna go straight down to the bottom once again. Might as well refill my oxygen while I'm here. And down we go. I'm just gonna follow this cable. I got this. Here's hoping. Alright. And now we're gonna wait. We're just gonna wait for the sand. I really hope this works. We'll see. Hi. <laughs> I, oh, I got a new emo. Um, so for uh, tier 1 subscribers, you get a new hype hog bird emote. Uh, and then I've got a couple others on the other tiers. I'm like, I'm, I'm eager for one day be able to put all of those emotes onto tier one. Being patient in this planet makes you anxious. Yeah, like, just coming slowly for the death. And I don't want to land on these, uh, this, uh, 
cactus. Hey, Allie. I, oh man, I think this is gonna work. As long as I don't squish. Ugh, it's fine, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. All right, that's good. Hell yeah, hell yeah, okay. You've gotta be kidding me. Seriously? I can't go through here? Game, that's so rude. All right, well, you're all... Can I go this way? How about this way? Oh, I'm so dead. How about this way? Ooh, okay, all right, all right. I was so ready for the game to just be trolling us. All right, now where are we? Uh, I don't like that. This is new. You're here, but you're lurking. Uh, while you're on your phone? Sounds good. Okay. All right, where are we now? Have we been here before? No, we haven't been here before. Sometimes I guess I remove warp core. Where do these go? Do these ones go to Brit Brittle Hollow? I'll take an empty one. Oh shit. Oh, I'm so glad this worked. Also, like, did this do anything? Is this just like, insert a warp core? All right, let's try this one. No? Alright, let's try this. I should really read everything before I, uh, insert work core. I should probably read this stuff to like actually know what's going on. Looks like there's another thing I can move. Oh, I can power this. Probably. Okay. Let's read this. Hey, Orc! Welcome in! Records show Nomai arriving at the warp receiver on Brittle Hollow very slightly before departing from the White Hole Station. Rami and I are devising an experiment to test if it is a real phenomenon or simple machine error. In theory, we want to try to reproduce... Um, is a negative amount of time elapsing between something entering the black hole and exiting the white hole at its destination. Initial things first. Our experiment setup will first pair a small black hole core with a small white hole core to mimic the setup on white hole station, okay? Hypothesis. It is possible for an object to exit a white hole before entering the corresponding black hole. Oh, Orc, I, I love when you spam emotes. Especially when they're my emotes, because I, I love my emotes. I think your emotes are awesome, too. Like, I feel like the, uh, I feel like emotes are really difficult to read because they're so small, right? But yours are very legible. 
So props to your artist. An update. Our experiment here re uh, reproduced the anomaly in arrival and departure times, but Pi is unconvinced it's more than an experiment error. I hope to strengthen the effect to render it visible to the unaided eyes. To that end, we've decided to try adding more energy. I imagine the Sunless City's energy supply should prove sufficient. All available energy has been rerouted from the city to our experiment. Rami and I are about to run a new test. Hypothesis confirmed. Hypothesis confirmed. I saw it. Pi saw it. Hypothesis confirmed. This is beyond extraordinary. This changes everything. What a beautiful day for the intersection of abstract theory and practical application. Of note, Rami, Yaro requests that we let him know before we reroute energy to the experiment. I'd hate to leave him in the dark. Interesting. So this has to do with them uh, noting how um, uh, when we arrive somewhere and, and leave somewhere, it's a different uh, dif different time. Because I remember them pointing that out earlier. The Southern Observatory is asking if creating a 22 minute interval is possible. That is, to have something arrive 22 minutes before it is actually sent through the warp. We've learned the negative interval of time between departure and arrival can be increased by adding more energy to the warp core. Problematically, the energy required to extend the interval increases at an exponential rate. Hypothesis, creating a 22 minute long interval is possible, but we are currently unable to generate the necessary energy. Rami and I believe it would be necessary to invent a whole new method of producing energy and a thrilling but enormous undertaking. We would also require advanced warp technology able to handle such energy. We would, uh, we would also likely need an enormous space to fit these proposed en uh, new energy and warp technologies together. The only location large enough would be Ash Twins. The, high en the energy is currently unavailable, you say? You're a gas pie. My pun is unintended, Rami, so I believe it's you who's airform. Yeah, what a specific interval. That was the first thing I noticed, too. Um, it's like, hmm, wait a minute, isn't that exactly how long uh, our resets are? The Ash Twin Project will be one of our biggest undertakings, metaphorically and physically. To build it, we need a way to travel quickly between Ash Twins and each location that holds crucial project materials. What if we used warp towers like the one we have on the White Hole Station to connect Ash Twins directly to each critical location? Of note, each tower on Ash Twins will warp to a different planet. My gratitude to those who noted my uh, imprecise language. Yes, the sun is not a planet, I believe. This has been sufficiently clarified. Kindly stop reminding me. <laughs> we can design each tower to visually reflect its warp destination. The giant's deep tower, for instance, could reassemble a cyclone, and we could model the timber hearth tower after a geyser mountain. Poke, Root, uh, and I can begin work on this immediately in the Black Hole Forge. This will keep us busy. All right, cool. So maybe we should check out th check out those geysers on Timber Hearth. I haven't been there yet. Oh, what were y'all saying? Working, working, working. Okay, what's up here? And then I'll go back down and I'll start messing with things. Oh, and then this is just the exit. Yeah! Alright, cool! Finally! So we got power going to this thing. We want one... ...to be 
a black hole and one to be the white core. Whoa! That's cool. I feel like we kind of figured this out already by just falling into the center of uh, Brittle Hollow. What happens if I do it the other way? I bet it's the same thing. What time is the baking stream tomorrow? All right, so I I um I think I'm still gonna do that. I I mean I I should I definitely am gonna do that. I think today I've just been like a little bit frazzled, and so I'm like I don't want to do anything. But no, I'm planning to do it. Uh, probably in the afternoon, early afternoon. Um, uh, maybe around like one is kind of what I'm thinking. Uh, because I have to let everything cool before I leave for dinner plans um so that i can bring them with me um without having the icing just like melt everywhere so probably gonna do like one o'clock it's probably gonna be about an hour long um yeah that's the plan that's the plan i'll once i have like a, a firm time i'll post it in the discord um but how's my day off been it's yeah it's been okay i like I've heard back from some apartments that I was interested in that they're actually not going to work out. And so, like, that was pretty disappointing. Um, but, yeah, that's that's the apartment grind. Sous chef KY the cat will be there, too. Yeah, he said he'd show up. It's my birthday, so I don't think he can say no. But, yeah, he's going to make a guest appearance. Get in there. You don't know why, but you adore when couples stream, so you're excited. <laughs> I'm glad. I'm excited too. I don't know why I can't get it to like go in. Oh, maybe it can't go into the white one. It's it's only one way, maybe. I think it's one way. Yeah, I think I think it's gonna be really cute. Um, the audio is gonna be terrible. I'm gonna warn you all right now because I'm just gonna be using like my webcam mic because I that's that's really all I have aside from this headset and I can't really walk around a kitchen with a headset on that's wired. So it, that's that's I'm I'm gonna keep it short. <laughs> And I'll just uh do some just chatting while uh while I mix all the ingredients together, have have KY mix the ingredients together. So Oh yeah, and then what are these on the wall here? This experience is crazy. Yeah, learning all this stuff. These are just like referring to each of the different planets, so each of the different energy labs. That's what these things are that we're seeing all over the place. Did we do this one? I don't think we did. Maybe we did. Just checking. Before we leave. Amazon one day or wireless headphones real quick, yeah. I think, like, I even would consider doing something like that for the occasion, because, like, I probably will do baking streams every now and again, but for two people, then it's, like, two headsets, and then how do you, like, how do you set that up? So. I don't know. More baked streams. I really like baking, so um, I can see myself doing them every now and again. I might make it like a point redemption, like for 100,000 points, I'll like bake a cake on stream or something like that. I think that'd be fun. Ow! 
just go straight into the cactus. Alright, let's go to my ship. It is wild to me how, um, whenever I'm trying to, like, figure out how to get somewhere, I think it takes forever, and in actuality, it really doesn't take that long to get there, uh, if you know what you're doing. I guess that's the whole game. Uh, uh, suit, there we go. And I like these text descriptions, how it's just like a shortened version of what we already know. It's very much more digestible um, for when you're just like looking back at all this. Um, wires tend to trip you up and you've broken stuff so you try to get wireless when you can. Yeah, that's fair. Designs for each of the towers on Twin's equator. Uh, each tower warps to a different planet. Although many Nomai were quick to note that the sun is not actually a planet. <laughs> each tower was designed visual to visually reflect its warp destination. The towers are uh, allowed the Nomai to quickly travel between Ash Twin and all of their locations. Oops. Crucial to the Ash Twin project. Cool. Well, that feels like it was a really good step. I feel like we we accomplished something. The logs are really good at explaining what you've seen. Great way to see. Great way to organize your thoughts if you've forgotten something or missed it when reading. Yeah, I I've definitely forgotten things like as I've been playing. So at some point, maybe during the stream or maybe even just after stream, I'll um I should uh. I want to see if the uh, sun station is still here. I should just sit down and try to um, read through everything and just refresh my memory. I don't see it. I don't believe the sun station still exists. I think it's been eaten. window over there. A little princess. Sitting on her pillow looking out the window. Another place I wanted to check out um, is the... Oh yeah, so here we can see the the white star, I guess we'll call it. Um, and then the black hole. You try to get the logs a good once, once through each death. That's smart. <laughs> Ellie, yeah, she is. So I'm pretty sure I've been here and they say that you have to go to the other side to get in here and I've, I've been in here before, I know that much. Yeah, because this is broken. I remember. So what I want to do is go back into the tower. 
that was in here. Or on this planet. But I have to like wait until it goes to the other till it falls. Which it may have already. I don't see it. So let's back up. Actually, I guess we can just kind of fall into it, right? I apologize for everyone's ears in advance. This, like, low rumble is the worst thing ever. Here we go! Ugh! Worst thing ever. Alright, where's my tower at? Is that it? No, that's the cannon. But maybe we should go to the cannon anyways. Oh, stop moving. I don't know how I'm supposed to, like, park. <laughs> Alright, well, ship. Try not to go anywhere. Do your very best. It's already floating away. It's fine. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Have I checked any souls since yesterday? Uh, do you mean the logs? I haven't checked any logs since yesterday. Activate the cannon. Call the shuttle home. That went by so quick! The shuttle is currently resting at the quantum moon. Google to find solutions? No, absolutely not. Yeah, I I have been sticking well to the no uh, no hints, no spoilers as of yesterday. to get back to that tower, I'm gonna have to, um, be in the tower when it warps into space, because otherwise it's just, like, way too difficult to find. And here we go. It's not the sun. Where is the sun? There it is. Yes. Good to see that I can do a lot of stuff in just one run. I, well, so I was thinking about it a lot. So after my last run, um, I, I, well, I tried to get into the, yeah, the night gives me advice. Yeah, for sure. I was trying to get into that, uh, station, whatever, the high energy lab. And I tried a bunch of times and just like couldn't get it. And then I thought about it and I was like, I keep trying to go different ways, but maybe if I just like wait I can walk through it so I just like I was just stewing on it so the next thing that I want to try is another thing that I was trying to do last stream and it wasn't quite working um, is I'm gonna go to the twin twins again 
and I'm gonna try to get to the sun station. We're gonna give it a shot. Yeah! First try today. Felt good. I, I feel like I needed that after the last stream. I was just like halfway there on a lot of stuff. Also, hi, Somnific. I don't think I said hi to you yet. I heard the cat. I was like, what's the cat doing? Oh yeah, and I wanted to check out these things. Now that we know that they're related. We've been... Pretty sure I've been into that one. Okay. Alright, alright. Let's go. This game stuck with you for a long time. It still does. Ah, don't. No. This. Bad. Bad autopilot. Bad autopilot. God damn it. Autopilot, what are you doing? Everything's fine. Okay. I'm so disoriented now. Just get away. And then you know what I'm gonna do? I'm just gonna... Let's just do that. Oh, I, I thought I already... I went to the high energy lab on on the Ash Twin. You can't stop watching blind streams. I mean, I understand. I um I'll specifically seek out blind streams of some of my favorite games. This is fine. This is a fine spot. I'll leave it here. We're near the thing, so my chip won't get sent across. But I have to repair. Just on the off chance I come back. Take care of my things. I am proud. I am proud of myself. Yeah, getting like confirmation about how the the warp cores work with the black holes was very interesting. So now I want to try to get to the sun station, but I kind of have to wait for the planet to. There we go. Reveal yourself. I'm gonna go through all my fuel just sticking around. I have a feeling it's gonna be this one. Just because it's the first one that shows up. You've seen so many blind streams of Final Fantasy VII Remake already. I feel like, um... I like it because it feels like you're playing it for the first time, too. Oh, yeah. No, I completely understand. Alright, so it's not going to be that side. It's going to be this side. Let's get out of the way. Endlessly watch this game in Wander Song. I haven't played that game, either. I'll have to check it out. My, um, my next game that I'm planning to stream is going to be uh, Lost Ember, which is a little indie game. Um, I saw it on Kickstarter and like was interested. Um, I'm 
door. Um, and it just looked really cute. So I was like, yeah, I'll play that. Um, and then next month I'm going to play, uh, da, da. Oh my God, I can't, I can't think today. I'm going to play some, ow, Subnautica Below Zero. There we go. Okay, so it's maybe not this one. Because I don't think I can stand on the top here. I don't think it'll work. I have to be on that platform. It comes out on May 15th, I believe. another one. Pretty sure I've read that. Maybe I'll grab it just in case. You're looking forward to Turnip Boy commits tax evasion for the title alone. That's a that's a quite a title. I'm interested based on the title. Also, hello Jen. Welcome in. It's the same one. More doors. Waiting for the doors. Three minutes of oxygen? How'd that happen? Pretty sure I've read all this. Yeah. Alright. So this is the first one that I've been able to see and stand on. That's unfortunate. Alright, well, I guess we'll go back. I don't, I mean, unless I guess I can try to, uh... Hey, that sent me back. Alright, cool. I guess I was just coincidental. I was just lucky. There's this one. Oh, man, that looked like it lined right up with the sun station for a second there. That hurts. Alright. This one might be broken because of the glass on top. having trouble getting into this one because of the, uh, the cactus. Oh, it's fine. I'm fine. Everything's fine. Oh, 
this is the, uh... I recognize the shape from the lab. Let's hang out in here for a second. I don't think I've been in here. Hey, Loof. Welcome. Can't figure out if it's like old school Isaac um, or Legend of Zelda. There's a game that I am, um, oh, okay, I was worried it was going to send me there. There's a game that I am interested in that, like, touches on a lot of my interests, and it's, like, avian lawyer or something. Um, I forget what the actual name is, uh, that's not what I meant to do. Send me back. Where are we? Thank you. That's what I wanted. But yeah, like, I love birds, okay? Bird- I just love birds. As evidenced by my emotes, I am a bird person. Um, I don't own any birds, and I never will, because they are not good pets. Uh, however, I also just have a habit of reading legal advice forms um, just out of like curiosity of how things get handled so this didn't work this either didn't work or I was too impatient to not just like sit on one and wait to go to the lab but I think the lab is now gone or the uh, sun station is now gone avian attorney yeah that's it Allie avian attorney um, and I'm just so curious Oh, this is the final stop on that. So, all right. I mean, the sun's coming around. I have. I think it's too late to get to the sun station. Whoa! Did I go through the sun? I think I went through the sun and landed on Giant's Deep. Alright, well, we're here now! <laughs> Tell you about the weirdest games. There's a lot of weird ones out there! Oh, I forgot that there's, like, no gravity. Or the gravity is punishing on this. Uh, the tornado. So we have been in there. We figured out we had to go from underneath. I know there's more that I have to find on this planet, but I don't know if I can really do it without my, uh... Without my ship, unfortunately. Oh, come on. Alright, we'll go around. Yeah, that was super weird, Allie. Like, your stream just totally dipped for a minute there. Also, that's interesting that, like, it kind of locks on to, um, a location. Oh, nope, don't send me down. Don't take me. And 
this tower I'm also interested in. I'm also curious about. So, I know that there is a teleporter or whatever, elevator, I'm going to call it an elevator, from that middle area. But I can't get to it. This one. Or maybe there isn't. Alright, so how do I just get into this spot? If I have to fly through here, it's going to be a rough, rough journey. Ow, 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 ow. Well, I guess if you're landed on them, it's fine. <laughs> Although, I'm going to die. Just, yeah, I'm just going to die. That kind of worked, though. I was like getting there. <laughs> I was get getting through it. Determined the the game was scared. For sure. Skywalking. I kinda wanna try that again and just like navigate just like if I just did a little bit better I would have made it I don't know if that's the solution I don't think that it is but it it could be <laughs> the cactus corridor looks rough it does it's also possible that my I don't know I can't like take a health pack with me So I do have a couple of new uh, channel point redemptions, um, thought I'd mention that, and I've got, I've refreshed the question of the day, in case anybody is interested. You guys need to pay more attention to the game because uh, you've been watching me play this for a week and still don't have a fucking clue what's happening. I mean, I barely do. Bioshock Infinite- Bioshock Infinite was a game that you thought you would love and ended up hating. Interesting. I really liked Bioshock Infinite. I thought it was pretty good. Like, all in all, like, I know it's not as good as the earlier Bioshocks. Dark Souls 3? Aren't you playing that now, Dave? <laughs> Pillars of Eternity. I haven't- I think I've watched you play that one. I haven't played it myself. Yeah, just not nearly as good as Bioshock 1. Makes sense. Paper Mario st uh, sticker star. Yeah, the answer for me um, of that question was actually um, Shelter 3 I was very disappointed with after playing it on stream um, and I was also very disappointed um, I was very disappointed with uh, da, da, Life is Strange 2 which I'm not going to talk about too much because uh, Orc is currently playing it but I was, I was disappointed with that one unfortunately So I'm just waiting for some of the sand to let up so I can get back to that platform that I was just at. Yep, 
You loved everything about Infinite except the ending. It just felt like a cop-out and kind of anticlimactic. Yeah. Didn't the studio dissolve after that game came out also? I remember that being a thing. Don't forget about my landing cam. Yeah. I've used it a couple times. I think I just haven't gotten the muscle memory for it yet. But right now I'm just kind of waiting for the uh, that tower to come up. Get a little distance. Come on. Show your face. There it is. Ha ha. All right. Down we go. Yeah. All right. Uh, it's your first FromSoft game to put in perspective. And if they're all like, th like that, it's a no from you. lack of a plot. There's lore, but everything you're doing feels kind of pointless. Love for Dave to play Fall in Order. Enjoy the mechanics with a more concrete story. You know, you, you put it on my radar, Allie. Um, I know you're talking to Dave there, but it's I've been thinking about it too. Where to go? Is that it up there? Yeah. All right. We'll wait for the sand to pass, and then we'll go in. It's a better Star Wars movie than Star Wars. You almost need a lore escort to appreciate the story of Souls. That's a lot to to like ex from a game you're playing. Like, if you need someone to, like, walk you through a game, I don't know, that, that kind of... Oh, hey, maybe I can just, like, walk through here now. Ha! <laughs> hey, that worked! So I'll get the door open. Please go to the sun station. Please. I'm gonna wait. We're waiting. I'm just gonna wait here. Uh, you agree. You're a little lazy. Um, and you want... Uh, da -da. Don't, don't send me... Sitting there. Please, 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 please. Yes! <laughs> oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so glad that worked. Oh, I'm honestly like so, so floored that that, that worked. I'm, I'm freaking out. Okay. Some transportation hype. Opens the emergency door. Whoa! That's so cool! Oh, new sound? New music? Alright. Oh, oh, up, 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 up. Down, down, down. Forward. Oh, we can do it. We got this. We got this. Ooh. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you. <laughs> 
mission. Science compels us to explode the sun. Uh, can't we change this? I don't enjoy working in view of such a morbid mission statement. Here's a better one. Mission. Determine if it's possible to prompt the sun to explode. You lack a sense of humor. At least I don't lack a sense of ethics. Kindly refrain from going supernova on me before the sun does. Idea. But it's accurate. We're going to create a supernova for the purpose of scientific progress. That's our mission. Our mission is to decide if such an irresponsible feat is even possible. Sounds like they did it. Ah, yes, scientific progress. Um, I was about to jump in there, realize that's a bad idea. I mean, I guess there is like something we can walk on. Is this just where we came from, maybe? No. This is cool, though. Stars reach the end of natural life cycle. Now approaching giant red stage. Warning, evacuate sun station. Approximate time until sun station is destroyed by expanding star. 3 minutes, 22 seconds. Approximate time until star's death. 14 minutes and 52 seconds. I have 3 minutes. Oh my god. Alright. This is like... This is wild to me. Might have to come back here. No, my statue. That's where we came in. We're definitely gonna get eaten by the star. I don't see anything that I can, like, put on those platforms. Here? Gimme. Gimme, gimme, gimme. these guys. Okay. What happened? Did the sun station not fire? It fired, Yarrow, but it failed. The sun barely responded. There were in infinitesimally infinitesimally small surface level changes, but they were barely visible, even to the third eye. The sun station is useless. It will never, and I could never, cause the sun to explode. I don't know what comes next, my friends. I suppose we must start over, but I'm unsure how to start over. Return, uh, return to Ash Twin first, my friend. Perhaps a change of task would help. Spire noted a comet approaching the star system that we'd like to investigate. Hi, I hurt for you. My friends, we all know how hard you both worked. I can only offer my compassion. How are you? How is Idea? We're well, Yarrow, or as well as can be expected given the circumstances. Though disappointed. I may have dis I've disagreed with exploding the sun, but I never wished the device would fail. I'm I hoped our terrible work was finished. Okay. Well, how long do I have? Three seconds. <laughs> Two minutes and three seconds. Are there any more of those? I mean, I can always come back here, but... This new music is cool. I'm glad that I haven't been listening to the soundtrack, because I wanted to make sure I um, got to listen to all the music organically while I was playing. Not, like, recognize tracks as they started. And then I'll catch up on chat. We have a very limited time frame. What's up here? Hello, friend. Thanks for keeping my memory for me. And nothing else over here? I 
thought there would be a little bit more to interact with. Uh, just for like the those um, those core chips, whatever they're called, or like another one of these, maybe another scroll. I don't see anything. The sun's definitely getting closer. It's kind of hard to tell, but... I wonder if we can go back. What a, what a way to go. Just eaten by a quickly expanding sun. So dead, we're dead. Oh, we're dead. Here we go. Uh. All right. Only three minutes. Death by star. Yeah, the bones are sad. <laughs> like to go by star, adding that to your funeral arrangements. The music is composed in a way that you have to witness the events. Yeah. Yeah, that's really cool. It reminds you of the restaurant at the end of the universe. Yeah, yeah. I've read Hitchhiker's Guide. I don't know if I've read that one, though. Alright, well, let's... Let's check our log. According to the Nomai computer, our sun reached the end of its natural life cycle. There's still more to explore in this in the sunless city. You love the movie too? Yeah, I remember enjoying the movie. Alright. So where do I want to go next? Because that was a that was two big pieces of information that we just figured out. So um centralized chamber inside the Ash Twins was physically sealed off by an immensely thick protective shell. I know my plan to construct technology capable of producing a 22 minute negative time interval on Ash Twin. Every memory recorded by a Nomai statue is transmitted to a cor corresponding sword unit within Ash Twin. But we don't know how to get there yet. want to go back here because I have no idea what could be left to explore so maybe we'll do that maybe we'll just go here can I mark it hell yeah let's go there I kind of want to explore there again maybe talk to the guy again now that we know we know a lot more now so maybe we should go talk to everyone again Alan Rickman is Marvin. I haven't seen that in so long. Yeah, the marker is really good. Always nice to see Gabbro.
perfect. <laughs> Sir, I'm back. I have questions about your island. Flawless. <laughs> It could have gone wrong at any second, but it did okay. So I know that there's this tunnel here, but I'm pretty sure that it doesn't go anywhere. Like, I don't think there's anything... Like, it just goes around to the other side. Let's talk to him. You know, I kind of wish I'd build a hammock before we ended up in this time loop. Oh no, he builds it every time. <laughs> I found something. Oh, alright. Well, I thought it would give more information here. I've already talked to him about the inside of the island. What should I explore? At the start of every time loop, I keep seeing a flash of... Uh, a bright flash in the sky... Something's happening up there in orbit around the planet. I think with I, I he could be talking about yeah no he's talking about the uh, the shuttle that explodes and we get that we we went to it once the probe that was like went out into the deep deep um, space deep space. You totally rent on Amazon so we can watch Hitch uh, Hitchhiker's Guide. You know, I'd be down for that. You can screen share over Discord, but it is um, not great. Um, depending on the platform, there are a bunch of different... Um, there are a bunch of different... Uh, never mind. A bunch of different streaming services will just let you do like a party mode type thing. I can't talk today. I'm sorry, guys. Thanks for bearing with me. Oh, can't get up there. You wouldn't mind renting it so everybody could watch. Yeah, movie nights are so fun. I want to do a movie night soon for uh, Redline. Because it's not a very well-known movie, but it's super, super good. Um, so that's that's something I've been like thinking about for a while and just haven't set up yet. Redline is, like, a Japanese animated movie um, that's about a race, but it's just, like, so ludicrous in every way. It's really fun. I haven't figured out how to get to the core of this planet, either. Yeah, Orc has a movie night on next Saturday, I think, for the Mortal Kombat movie. Mortal Kombat, can't wait. Twenty fourth, is that Friday? Maybe it's Friday and not Saturday. I don't know what days are. I don't know what else could be on this island. Maybe there is something under it and I just have to wait for it to get picked up by the weird gravity thing. So maybe I'll just like wait in my ship for a second. Mortal Kombat! Or it comes out of lurking for Mortal Kombat. Okay. Just in time. Whole 
lot of not nothing. What if what happens if I go back into here when there's no No, I still can't. I was hoping I'd be able to go to the center while all the islands are up in in space. like the center. Looks awfully sus, but I can't get in there. I can try the other side. Feeding the critters? Sounds good, Allie. I know that he said that the other island has like a really good spot to uh, to watch the explosion from. Let's go talk to him one more time. Maybe I'll head back over there before we loop. Yeah, maybe we miss dialogue. Did that just end the loop? <laughs> Did. 
All right. Well. Um. What for, Pyro? It did, yeah. No, I, I realize. So, like, I don't know. It, it kind of does, and it kind of doesn't. Um, it, unless you're, like, if you're hinting at something, don't don't hint at it. I'll, I'll, I'll get there. Like, if you're suggesting that now I can meditate to reset the loop, um, like, maybe. Yeah, they're meditating. I would have found that as soon as I paused the game, so it's, it's good. Don't, don't worry. I know my hypothesized the quantum moon. Nah, it's all good. It's all good. Nah, it's it's good. It's good. Going through some of these that we didn't read yet. Uh, Feldspar is alive. They uh, crashed their ship and now camping inside a huge anglerfish skeleton. Feldspar doesn't uh, think my scout tracker. Frozen jellyfish. Right, they're not edible. Only useful for insulation from electricity. I'm sure that'll come in handy later. This island is where Nomai built the orbital probe cannon. Three access ways branching off from the central hub area. Yep. Yeah, I remember these, and then I, I got here, but I couldn't do anything because they were all broken off. Hey, Keen. Yeah, I'm enjoying the game a lot. This game is very cool. I can see why everybody loves it so much. Absolutely. Yeah, so this is what I'm trying to get to. Construction yard saw something sink beneath the underwater current. They previously thought was impossible. Hmm. I could try sending my probe. Uh, I'm just trying to decide, like, where I should go next. I don't think I'm ready to go to the Quantum Moon yet. There's still some pieces of information that I'm missing. Um, all, th all, all three escape pods were launched from something called the Vessel, which was badly damaged. We could go back to the Sunless City, because I'm not sure what is there that we haven't found yet, because we've been kind of thorough. Still many options, but we're really filling out the map. Yeah, yeah, it feels like it. This game gives you so many options. 
uh, when it ties, uh, but when it ties it all together, so good. Yeah, I can, I can see that for sure. So yeah, I guess we'll go back to the twins. We'll go back to the Sunless City and we'll... Now that we can kind of get there fast, <laughs> maybe we'll find something new. You're back, we have to lurk while you grab dinner? Sounds good. Enjoy your dinner, let us know what you get. Interesting, the planets are all lined up there. Just noticing that. Ta da! To the city we go! It is kind of cool how this game kind of prevents you from, like, wandering aimlessly for hours, you know? Because of the, the loop, you're kind of forced to make a decision about what you're doing for that particular day? Loop? Whatever? I think that's... it's a very interesting mechanic. have this time we'll just do this second highest second lowest second deepest there we go second deepest level this one like I'm pretty sure we've done all of this stepping stone cave but isn't this like how to get to the angler fish I don't remember there being much else in here yeah I don't want to just like waste time in this cave without a goal been in here a lot. I remember getting squished. We've read the cha the the writing from the children. That goes to the other lab. I wonder, actually, I wonder if this area changes when we reroute the power. Let's go back. Hopefully we have time. We'll give it a shot. Hmm. 
may not have time. Oh, maybe we do. Oh, hell yeah, we do. Just in time. Yeah, the good old sand anxiety. Oh, God. That's fine, that's fine. Alright. Oh, that's right. And then this is a whole bag of dicks. Do I have to, like, wait for this sand? I think it was this one. The sand anxiety is so bad. Let me through. And then I think it's this way. Yes, all right. So we're gonna go up here, we're gonna reroute the power, and then we're gonna try to go back to the Sunless City if we can. I think we can. Uh. Oh, nope. I'm going through all of my, uh... Oxygen and my... Everything's fine, don't panic. Okay. There we go. Very nice. Alright. Let's set this up just in case it matters. I don't know if it does. So those were already there, so I don't know what this power actually does, but we're now going to leave. I think it'd be kind of wild if this actually matters because it's so many steps, but it's one of the few things that we can like confirm. Fuel level critical. Where's my ship? to go back to the Sunless City. There's probably a better way to do this. There's probably another route from the Sunless City. Or from the High Energy Lab. But I didn't look around and we already left. So here we are. <laughs> Just going around again. As quick as we can. Probably just gonna be dark. There's just not gonna be any lights on. It's just, it's dark now. <laughs> Wild. Who would have thought the lights are out? Yep. 
Yeah, now it is the Sunless City. Um, let's try going back over here. Didn't this go somewhere? Is this any different? Close my window. Be right back. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. My neighbors, uh, the building over, smoke a lot of weed. And uh, all of their, all of their uh, smoke drifts into my windows. Don't, uh, don't give me any hints. We're not gonna do any hints on this um, stream. I want to try to try to figure stuff out um, on my own because it seems like whenever um, I have a question about the game, the game kind of answers it for me just by exploring around and, and trying things. So I'm trying to avoid any kind of hints going forward, I think. You have neighbors that smoke, but you live in an apartment, so it comes through the vents. That's even worse. Like, so I, I have no problem with people smoking, um, like, cigarettes or marijuana or whatever. Um, uh, but it's like, having to smell it, like, from somebody else is just, like, kind of annoying. I wonder if that's coincidence that everything's lined up. Yeah, I've definitely done this before. Light a campfire and doze off. Does that just reset the loop? I mean, I guess it would, is my guess. Let's try it, just for, uh... Yeah, this is just gonna reset the loop. I just wanted... Or maybe not. Oh, interesting. It just passes time. That's cool, I like that. I think that's interesting. It's like, what could I possibly be waiting for? Hmm. Oh, I didn't mean to fall down here. Back up. Specified it's not a hint in neither spoiler. Okay. There's a slight difference between the two experiences. Gotcha, gotcha.
this calendar, this uh, map thing is going whack. It's freaking out. All right, let's see. We're getting close to the end of the. Uh, close to the end of the loop. So let's see. I want to go back here for a moment. If we have time. I gotta say, I love the mechanics in this game. Like, as difficult as I find some of the uh, navigation to be, it's very unlike any game I've played. Uh, actually, I wanna go here. I can't walk on to. Super unique for sure. Yeah! I've just never seen anything like it. Walking on to things. For autopilot. That's dark bramble. I don't want dark bramble. It's weird, when I select something or try to unselect it, it automatically selects the sun. And like So, we determined that this is one way, right? Let's try flying into it just for fun. Yeah, it will not let us. And I don't see the... Don't see the, um... Oh, no, 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 I don't want to fly into you. Okay. Whew. Whew. Nope. Oh, the autopilot's on. I was like, why am I going into the sun? I'm like heavily pushing the other direction. I mean, it might be too late. I might be going into the sun. Maybe not. Maybe not. All right, now take me in. Giant Steep looks creepy from the dark side. It sure does. Okay. So I want to get back into that big tower in here. If I can. I think I'm just gonna abandon ship here. I'm just gonna duck. Ship, good luck. Because I believe this is where I want to go. Maybe not. Oh, whoops. I, for I forgot that I'm on a gravity plate. Oh, come on. 
Oh, that's right, we can't go higher because it's blocked off. Um, come out here. And I don't think we can go higher. Oh, and that's all the time we have. I'm trying to remember where that tower is. Maybe it just like already flew off and I just like missed it and then just like didn't see it or something. That must be what happened. Oh, here we go. At least we can watch the explosion. That's convenient that I landed right on this thing. Pretty sure I've been in here before, but we're gonna miss the explosion. Sorry, guys. Oh no, this is where I wanted to be. No, no, it's not. This game's confusing. This is another teleporter. Oh, this doesn't stop time. I thought that reading those froze time. Cool. Well. Let me get out of the way of... There we go. This cat. Hanging out. Being very cute. I think... I'm going to call it here for tonight. I wanted to do a shorter stream because I still have to make dinner. Um, but also, but also, uh, our good friend, Boiled Garlic, one of my mods, is currently on the affiliate uh, train. They are four uh, followers away from making affiliate. So uh, I would love if you guys stuck around for the raid and... Please, please give Garlic a follow if, if you like. You don't have to, but it would be very much appreciated. Um, and then I will see you guys next with more Outer Wilds probably on Wednesday. That's the last day of my vacation, mini vacation before I go back to work. Um, and tomorrow I'm planning to do the, the baking stream. So that is the plan for the next couple of days. So let's pull up the raid and thank you all for hanging out thank you pyro and thank you uh kusanagi uh i do i do appreciate your help and uh dave and keen we, we had a lot of people in here today it's very cool and i'm always happy to see you guys your cat just yelled at you and it looks like garlic is playing hades Thank you. Yeah, have a great night, everyone. Thanks again for hanging out, and I will see you next time.